everyone, my name is Python and welcome back to another episode of Ark Survival Evolved. I know it's been a little while since the last episode, but guys, I've been busy in real life. I've had some uh, berries, bits of bobs that I had to get done. So yeah, but anyways, the fact of the matter is we are back and we are good to go. So like I say, I have been busy since the last episode. One of the things I did do was start transferring some of the more important dinos from the old base to the new base here. Uh, we do have ourselves the Iguanodon. We've got all of our raptors, both regular and tech raptors. Uh, we have ourselves our moss chops. We've got Phoebe, the poop generator. We've got Tara, the triceratops. And we have three sarcos, Samuel being the new one that was bred from Sandra and Stuart. And of course, we've got Tucker here. We also have the Hesperonis Harriet up in the house there. So yeah, guys, lots of things being done. So in today's episode, we are going to be going back to taming things. And guys, I think today is the episode we go for a Rex. That is what my friends, today we are going for a Rex. That is going to be very, very interesting. So if you guys are still excited for this series, then please do be sure to drop a like rating. Honestly, it would mean the world to me if you did that. If we can keep going with a thousand likes plus per episode, then that would be absolutely fantastic. Now, because I've killed quite a lot of tech animals in this game, I do have myself a fairly significant supply of metal. Look at this. We've got quite a lot here. So what this means is I can make the wreck saddle straight out. So let's go ahead and do that. And we'll be good to go. Now, it would be nice if we could try to be able to breed Rexes. I think that would be absolutely fantastic. Uh, because I think that Rexes might be a good plan to go for if we start going for the bosses. Now, I'm going to be honest with you guys. The different color obelisks in this world. The red one, the blue one, the green one. I don't know which bosses are under which. So, that's something we're going to have to find out as we go along. So... I'm just trying to think, do we actually have everything we need? I've got 54 Trank Arrows. I've got my armor. Uh, bear Trap. Oh, a large Bear Trap. Will a large Bear Trap do the job? I don't know. Let's have a look. So, can I make the large Bear Trap? Uh, there's the regular one. There's the large one. Immobilizes large creatures only. I can make like a few of these. Uh-huh. Might be a worthy idea. I don't know how much they weigh. We'll make three of them. Just in case. But yeah, I don't know. I've never actually used bear traps before. Like legitimately, I've never ever used a bear trap before. So this should be very, very interesting to see if it can immobilize a Rex. Because if it does, then we're in for a good time, guys. So yeah, we've got water. And well, we can fill the water up just a little bit here. Uh, boom. More water, please. There you go. You'll love to see it. Okay. And then we can have a little bit of a drink. And guys, we are taking Tucker for a bit of an explore. Also, you have a level up. So let's go and increase your damage. And yeah. Oh, we need to like increase his weight as well. Huh. Okay, yeah. We got rather a lot of weight going on here. So that's something to uh, bear in mind, I guess. We could go ahead and put like lower tier armor on. Like maybe the iron armor is a little bit too heavy for us right now. Yeah, I mean, we've, we've got plenty of armor going on. I mean, you look in here. Uh, wait, not, not, not in that particular one, but, uh, where's my gear chest? My gear chest, aha! Yes, in this one. Yeah, we got, like, full sets of armor and stuff. We could go for the ghillie suit if we really wanted to. Yeah, let's do that. Weighs less, doesn't it? Aha! Uh -huh. I like that. Or we could go for even lower tier armor, which actually isn't that lower tier. Because, guys, check it out. We do have all of these uh, engrams and blueprints going on, right? Uh, oh, we need some more fiber, apparently. Okay, well, uh, that's... It's not exactly like it's uh, difficult to get, huh? We do have a sickle. Everything's looking good there. All right, so there you go. All right, now we can start putting all of this stuff on. And look at this. It's still got a 40 armor rating. This one's got 28. That's got 76 very nice. Uh, we've got our ghillie gauntlets and then the ghillie helmet. Okay, so we've got a little bit of a mix mash of armor going on. But you know what? I don't think that's uh, I don't think that's neither here nor there. I think we should be fine, honestly. I think we'll be good to go. So let's put our other stuffs away and let's go for a bit of an explore. We're looking for some rexes, ideally a high level one. Uh, so yeah. All right, guys. Oh, oh, jeez. Uh, that was weird. All right, boom. Let's go. We are going for the ride. I mean, we're a little bit quicker now, but not that much quicker, let's be honest. All right, guys. So in the meantime, we can do a little bit of an explore session. There does appear to be a beaver dam here, which means there's got to be some cast... Oh, wait, there's one right there. Casteroids. Right. Uh, that... That was a lot of wood. Okay. Uh, this is an issue. This is an issue. 
I would very much like to not die if I'm being totally... I, I can't move. I need to drop all the wood. Okay, well, uh, yeah, that went well, didn't it? I mean, a little bit of an XP boost is never a bad thing, right? I mean, there's an Alpha Raptor hanging around here. We could probably take it down. You know, we have the ability to fly our way out of any situation, pretty much. So, if we could... Wait, where'd he go? What the devil? What? Where did he go? Alfie? Alfie, Alfie, Alfie! Yeah! That'll do it, folks. That'll do it. All right, how many levels up? Three. Yeah. All right, so, uh, weight, weight, melee damage. Not bad, not bad. Okay, so, sadly, I don't think any of this is higher than what we've got going on. No, it isn't. Okay. Well, uh, pff, I mean, it's still decent, isn't it? We took down an Alpha Raptor. We got an Alpha Raptor claw. Well, guys, another kind of distraction. We do have ourselves a blue loot beam here. There could potentially be something decent in here. Come on, give me something. Oh, oh, whoa. Oh, oh, baby, hang on a minute. I've got to have a look at those. What's that? Journeyman. Oh, that's not as good as the one we've already got. But we do have ourselves Journeyman Gilly Gauntlets. It takes 23 organic polymer, but gives you a 93 armor rating. And 196 durability. That's very nice. Very nice. Not not just very nice. Very nice. Just like PewDiePie's. Very nice. Yes. That's kind of cool. I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. We need to start going for more loot beams, in my opinion. Like, like I said, like at the beginning of the series, I increased the loot quality of the loot beams. Uh, so it's worth going for. They really, really are. Even if it's just surrounded by freaking titanosaurs, I think it's worth it. I do. Especially if it's a red one. That'll be cool. Oh, this is an actual sword. I thought it was a freaking blueprint. Well, I'm a dumbo, aren't I? Well, there you go. Let's have that on. Uh, oh. Oh, my bear traps are still there. So, uh, yeah, I accidentally dropped off some stuffs before when I was taking out those castoroids. Uh, Trank arrows were one of them, but I managed to get them back just about. But I'm pretty sure we may have lost one or two other things, potentially. Oh, no, there's the bowler. Decent. We got a good sword, eh, my friends? Pretty awesome. All right, so where are these pesky rexes, huh? They've got to be somewhere. I know of a location where they could be. In fact, two locations where they could be. Dead Island, where there's a bunch of carnivores, hostile you know, bums. And also, there is like a sort of beach to the west, which is where I'm now going. It's about, you know, about 50, like halfway up that map there. So it shouldn't be that difficult to find it. There's a car note down there. Uh-huh. Interesting stuff, interesting stuff. There's a bunch of over raptors here. Ooh. There's all sorts of stuff going on, huh? Come on. There's got to be some rexes somewhere. High level ones, ideally. Come on. I'm hoping that 52 Trank Arrows will do the job. Also, I have a level up. So, let's go and increase our movement speed again. I think we'll go for 130% movement speed, uh, you know, just all in all. Uh, but after that, we'll start, you know, increasing other stuff. So, maybe Fortitude once again, melee damage, that kind of stuff. Uh, but, yeah. Guys, can you remember this location from one of my previous Let's Plays? This was another base location that I had going on, huh? Hey, it was a nice place, but there really wasn't too much going on around it in terms of resources and whatnot. So, you know, we kind of quickly uh, booked our ideas up and moved somewhere else, didn't we? So, yeah, awesome stuff. Well, anyways, guys, let's continue north until we find some Rexes. All right, guys, so the location in question is this little beach area coming up here just before the snow biome. Now, for whatever reason, they always spawn, like, right next to the coast over there. If I uh, remember correctly, yeah, there was always, like, a bit of a war going on, right? So I'm hoping that there will be Rexes. If there isn't a Rex here, I'm going to be a little bit sad. And we may have to go to Dead Island, which, to be honest, at my point... Although, uh, wait, is that a Rex or is that an Allosaurus? I can't quite tell. I'm pretty sure there is a pretty, uh, you know, significant size difference, but I don't know. Hmm. Well. Ooh. Okay, so they... Oh my god, there is a small war going on over there. What the hell? Oh, that's a Rex! That's unmistakably a Rex! Hang on, I gotta go see. I gotta go see real quick. What level are you, sir? Uh, oh, jeez! Oh! You raw 
all there, baby. I want to see what level you are. Oh, Jesus! I, I didn't see what level he was. Can you, like... Ah, damn it! I keep seeing, like, a tiny fragment of his level. Come on, come on. Take it slow. 64. Okay, I, I, that's a pretty good start. That's a pretty good start. Right, now, the real question... Oh, God, there's raptors. Okay. Oh, oh I'm so nearly out of freaking... Uh, Oh, I'm so nearly out of stamina. That's not a good thing. You should never let your Tyranodon run out of stamina. You really, really shouldn't, because otherwise you're in a bit of trouble. Right, let's go for a little bit of stamina, actually. Right. Uh-oh, here he comes. Uh, stop your victory. Stop your victory. There you go. You're dead. Stupid idiot. Right, okay. So, guys, bear trap. Large bear trap, more to the point. Wait, where the devil did he go? He's over here, huh? Okay, right. If I could, like, somehow lure him over here... We might be in for a good time. Okay, guys, let's try this out. So, bear trap. Okay, bear trap and bear trap. Okie doke. Pick up. No, I don't want to pick it up. I mean, are you supposed? You're supposed to open it, aren't you? Aren't you supposed to open it? Right, let's try and lure this guy. Let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. Come on, Rexy, Rexy, Rexy! Come on! Yeah, you can do your little roar, roar, roar. Row your boat. Come on. Oh, mate, you are slower. You are slow as hell. Oh, right. So after the 30 seconds are up. Yeah, here we go. Come on, baby. Come on. You gonna work for me? You gonna work for me? Buddy, over this way. Wait, don't, don't. Buddy, over here. Come on. Come on. Get trapped. Get trapped in the thing. Did that do it? It did it. Come on. Load up. Boom! Go for it! Go for it! It worked! Oh, it's already up though! Oh my goodness me! Wow, that really didn't take long for him to escape from that. Holy Jesus! Okay. Hello? Oh, here he comes. Ah! <laughs> I don't want to die! I really don't want to die. Not this far away from home, broski. Right. And... Uh, woo! Okay. I can get about two shots in. Before I have to go. Go, 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 go. Okay, let's go for it. Na, 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 the epic battle music. Whoa! Yeah, baby. I'd be annoyed as well if I were you. All right. Come on. What? What is he doing? He appears to be struggling to be able to get over here. Oh, wait. No, not anymore. Uh. Time to go. Ah! 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 Oh my god! Oh my god! Tucker, get the hell over here! Tucker! Tucker, 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 Tucker! Here! Here! Stop it! Come over here, you stupid idiot! Thank you! Oh my gosh, what is wrong with you? Oh my word! Oh, I hate this guy sometimes. Jesus Christ! Are you trying to give me a heart attack? Well, I'll tell you something is bleeding working! You freaking noob! Right, you're now on passive! I don't care what happens, you're staying on passive, you stupid... Ah! Dumbo! Boom! Uh, buddy. Well, I hope the Rex wins, because otherwise I'm going to be a bit sad. I'm trying to tame it. I may have to... Oh, wait, no. The trike's getting killed. The trike's getting killed. The trike's out. Oh, that's a Sarko. I just trapped a Sarko. Okay. Well, that's always good to see, isn't it? Okay. Oh, stop it! <laughs> oh, my God. I'm so scared. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Can we get a third in? Ah! Oh. <laughs> oh, dang, dude. Holy God. All right. Come on. Oh, Jesus. Time to run. Now the Sarko's after me. I told you, man. This is a dangerous area. This is a dangerous area. Oh, my goodness me. Okay, come on. We can probably get another shot in. I mean, you appear to be going to the... Oh, wait. He's running away. He's running away. That means we're close. Guys, we're close. Oh, come on, man. Give it. Oh, that actually hit him. Give me this, man. Give me this. 
We're so close. Where's that freaking Sarko? That Sarko. Oh, he's out. We did it. Oh, let's go, baby. Oh, all right. Let's give you a little bit of that. Oh, please don't kill me. I'm going to be... Every single sound that is being made right now is freaking me out. I don't know what's around here. I know that there was a Sarko somewhere. I'm losing my voice so bad. I knew there was a Sarko around here somewhere. <clears throat> oh, there he is. Go on, get trapped. <laughs> oh, you dumbo. That didn't work out for... Oh, prime meat. Hey. That's actually kind of worth it. Hey, what do you got in here? Oh, Sarko skin. Good. Right, 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 right. Let's do this thing. Let's do this thing. Wait, where's the... Oh, you've got the prime meat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. Okay, prime meat, baby. This will be the way to go, right? Come on, man. Let's get some prime meat in this bad boy. And that should tame you a hell of a lot quicker. I hope. Before it goes out, hopefully. Hmm, cool. Well, we still got 20, 24 hours remaining. I did see another Rex. I am interested to see, A, what gender it is, and B, what level it is. I'm not entirely sure that 24 hours will be enough, though. So you're female, level 64. So what is this? If it's male, high level, then I might be all right. Raw! Was it male? Ra Was it male? It's female. It's female. It doesn't matter. I'm going to kill you, sir. Oh, I need a bit of stamina, and then I'm going to kill this Rex. Okay, okay, that's... Yeah, I'm not... I'm not killing a lot of time to uh, recoup my stamina here. Right, come on. Uh, yeah, little freaking destiny ghost, dude. You need to shut up. I'm busy. I'm busy trying to take out this freaking level 20 Rex. You butthead. Well, here we go. Whee! Wow, 500 damage. I mean, that's pretty decent, I'd say. Yeah. All right, we need to recoup a little bit. There we go. Here he comes. Here he comes. Or oh, here she comes. Here she comes. Jumpy come around the mountain when she comes. Oh, gosh. The lyrics do not... Uh, the lyrics do not fit the background music at all. Right. Yep, that, that in it. <clears throat> cool. I just want to take this Rex out for the, sake, for the sake of taking the Rex out. I don't really have any other reason. Oh, look at you. You look so... Uh, buddy, can you not poop? I am busy trying to kill a Rex. There you go. Right. Boom. We're looking good. More melee damage. Thanks, broski. Right. Ooh. Yeah, baby. Right, let's take out all of this meat. And I'm going to once again give the prime meat to the guy on the floor. Or the gal on the floor, more to the point. Uh, and then we'll be all right. So, what, how are you looking? 28%. That's pretty decent, right? Uh-huh. Nice. All right, guys. I mean, to be honest with you, as always, it's going to be more a case of just the waiting game, really. Uh, so let's just go and put all the prime meat on. This should last just a little bit longer than the other one because we killed that Rex just now, you know. So, yeah. All right. So 28% plus 31 levels means this Rex is going to be level 95, which is a semi-decent start. It's not exactly the highest level thing we've ever seen, is it? But uh, I think it's still pretty good. I think it's a good start. For a Rex. All we need is a male Rex. And then we can start breeding up these bad boys. Hell yeah. I'm looking forward to that. I'm, I'm hella looking forward to the ability to breed Rexes. I think that'd be fantastic. Do you know what guys? While we're here. And while we've got the Argentavis flying around. We've got a fair amount of them by the way. It might be a worthy idea. To get one. Oh. Yeah. That's cool. All right, Rianne. There you go, Rianne the Rex. Cool! Cool! Okay, so what else are we needing? Kiting character. Oh, right, right, right. so you got the... Ca yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, so, boom. Yeah, Argentavis saddle. We could potentially get an Argentavis as well, because those guys are great for transporting animals, right? Like, even, like, decent-sized animals. Might be a worthwhile idea trying to get one of those guys. However, the difficulty comes in the fact that those guys typically travel as a pack. You hit one of them, you hit all of them. They'll all come after you, just like freaking zombie pigmen. They are just nasty. Just nasty with a capital N. They really are. Oh, buddy. So, uh, I'll put you on... Actually, no. I'll keep you on passive, but I'll have you on follow. Right. So then. 
ladies and gentlemen, the Rex. Oh, damn, baby. Oh, this is fire. This is freaking awesome. Oh, this is cool. Okay. What kind of damage are you looking at? 532? No, I don't even know if that's good. What the heck is this? Fireworks flare gun skin. Go away. I don't need that. I don't need that in my life, fool. Come on, baby. Right, now then. Oh, he's so slow. But I... Th oh, oh, mate. Come on. Let's see what we can do with this gal. Whoa! Yeah! <laughs> right. Okay. Right. Come on. Let's find a larger tamers. We've got to try and tame one. At least one. Or just one, actually. That's probably all we can do with the uh, resources we have available to us. Aha, there's one. Right, I'll tell you what. Oh. Hello. Would you like to come over here, sir? Come on. Let's have you both follow me. Oh, mate. I love it. We got a freaking Rex. <laughs> oh, I'm so happy. Oh, jeez. Ah. Uh, come on. Uh, oh, jeez. Ah. Uh, uh, yep. Oh, got there to finish. There you go. Right, Argent Tavis. We could just kind of go for him. Level four? That's an insult, that is. Get out of here, you useless fat. Come on, man. We need something a bit higher level than four. Jeez, that's terrible. Oh, and now an Alpha Raptor has spawned in. Okay, Rexy. Let's set you on attack my target. Let's set you on attack my target. And ladies and gentlemen, Python A versus a second Alpha Raptor. Yee! You are going to die, sir. Oh, jeez. Are you going to attack him for me? Uh, yeah, this could... Oh, here we go. Here we go. Oh, Sabertooth's out of the game. Go on, Rexy. How's he doing? I don't really I don't really know how she's doing, to be honest with you. I need my stamina back. She's doing 36 damage. Wow. That's really not a lot, is it? Right, now I can come back in. Sweep back in. Yeah. Oh, Jesus. That's, that's a lot of stuff. All right, what do we get? Uh... Ramshackle hide gloves. Okay, did we actually get anything decent? Ooh, Mastercraft. Is that better? It is. Hey, we got a better pickaxe. Sweet. That's pretty good. <laughs> oh, dang, guys. Well, it appears that we have for ourselves an Alpha Kano. Is that an Alpha Kano or is it an Alpha? I think it's an Alpha Kano. An Alpha Rex is, like, unbelievably big. So, the real question is, can we do this? Oh, it is an Alpha Kano. Hello. Go on. Sick him, boy. Sick him. Don't accidentally kill him. Uh. I can't tell who's being killed here. Woo! Oh, we did it. Huh. That was easy. He is dead. And we have seven levels up. Well, freaking darn. All right, so we got ourselves a 198% freaking axe here, brother. Holy Lord. Okay, well, I mean, we're trying to go through a freaking Argentavis, but no. We're doing pretty well, huh? I'll take it. I'll take it. This is, We're doing pretty well here, my friends. Oh, what a shot. Okay, so we've got a level 72 Argentavis coming in. Uh Oh god. Oh god. Oh run! Oh he's coming after me. He's coming after me. He's coming after me. Pretty quick here. Um Yeah. God. Ah! Okay. Okay. Duh! I mean we're not actually losing that much health, to be honest. Oh, hang on. He's flying away. That can mean only one thing. Oh, he's down. 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 All right, guys. Argent Tavis. Obtained. All right. Rexy. 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 Right, right, right. You stay there, buddy. You have been like a low-slung MVP of this episode, uh, you know, Rian. You've been doing well. You've been doing well for me. So, there you go. Have yourself a little bit of meatage. Uh, it'd be nice if you had some prime meat. Oh, you do have some prime meat. 
Well, hell to the freaking yeah, we're going to put that on instead. <laughs> oh, mate, prime meat is the way to freaking go, guys. It is. It's just the way to go. It's the way to do things. Oh, cool. All right, so we ourselves have three levels up. So let's do the 130% movement speed. Let's go for melee damage and a little bit more weight. Why not? So at level 80, what can we get? Industrial Forge Compound Bow. Oh, baby. A compound bow could be a quite nice one to go for. All right. Requires arrows to fire. We do have ourselves a regular quet saddle, a vault. Uh, yeah, okay. So we'll have ourselves the compound bow. We'll have ourselves the industrial forge. That would take us a damn long time to get. I know that from experience from the previous series that we did. 2,500 metal lingots. If you're in the right place, it won't take that much. But honestly, it's more so the waiting. You know, you have to have yourself like a bit of an array of forges to get yourself a good amount of that in a fairly small amount of time. So anyways, uh, what saddles do we not have? Let's have a bit of a look, shall we? I've been trying to unlock them all as we go along. That We've got a Capro saddle, uh, Pelagornis, Donglio, Dire Bear. Okay, and then we've still got some stuffs coming up here. So yeah, I mean, to be honest, I said I want to go for the Pokemon, try and catch them all, try and tame every single creature in this, uh, in this map at least once. So it could be a cool idea. So... You are still not doing anything. Well, that's cool. Right, we do have an Argentavis saddle, though, so we should be all right. So, once again, guys, it is the case of the waiting game. So, yeah, not a bad episode, guys. We've got ourselves a Rex, and we also have ourselves an Argentavis. Two dinos that I actually really wanted to have. Hell to the air. Alrighty, guys, we've got ourselves a loot beam up the top here. Why not go ahead and see what it has? Ooh. Parasaur Saddle, Apprentice, decent, with an armor rating of 43.9. That, my friends, is the Tech Cave entrance. Wait, that means we're, like, near the center of the map, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Ooh. Is it the actual Tech Cave entrance? I'm interested. Let's have a look. Is this the same? Yeah, this is the same mountain we were setting up base at before, wasn't it? Yep, there it is. The Tech Cave access terminal. Ooh, look at that. So we need... A Gamma Broodmother Dragon, a Megapithecus Trophy. And you have to be level 60. I mean, guys, we're level 80. To be honest, we could probably take the Broodmother. I mean, the Broodmother is typically considered the, uh, the, the in air quotes, first boss. Um, so it could be worth doing that. It could be. I don't know. I don't know. Like I say, we need to uh, we need to really figure out what kind of direction we want to take the series in. But I honestly feel like the Broodmother might not be too far off the realms of possibility now, my friends. We have ourselves a Rex. All we need to do is, like, breed them up, right? And, oh, oh, jeez. Oh, there's the Argentavis. Hello. Oh, look at you. Level 107. Nice. Female as well. Okay, I'm going to call you Annie. Annie. Your name is Annie. There you go. Annie. Cool. Annie the Argentavis. Coolio. All right, so we have ourselves a new flying mount. Awesome. Oh, I forgot this girl acts as a smithy as well. Oh, okay. That's actually epic. That's cool. That That's actually really cool. Guys, check all this stuff out we can make. We can make a fabricator on the freaking go. I wonder if I could carry my Tyranidin. No. Doesn't look like it. Oh, mate. Nah. <laughs> Uh, but thankfully, the Argentavis can do many, many other things as well. And of course, again, once we start breeding these guys, everything's going to be fantastic. So, ladies and gentlemen, I think on that successful note, look at that right there. Looking very, very good. Right, let's get you out of the way. I want to show off my new dinos. There you go. Look at that, my friends. Look at that. That's a that's a sight to behold, isn't it? So let's have a little bit of a screeny. And ladies and gentlemen, like I say, ending the episode. Guys, thank you very much for watching. If you guys have enjoyed today's episode, as always, a big fat like rating, like rating, thumbs up, whatever floats your boat. will do the job very nicely. It helps out myself, the video, and the channel massively. It truly does. Hit the subscribe button and don't forget to ding that bell if you guys don't want to miss out on future content. But for now, it is time for me to bid you farewell. Thank you very much for watching. Have a fantastic rest of your day and I'll see you guys in the next one.